It's time! Coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight showdown. Well, nice to see this young fighter healthy and making the walk here tonight. His takedowns are just incredible. High amplitude takedowns, great technique, explosion really with every shot, and seemingly no telegraph as well. So even a fighter with good takedown defense, more often than not, is not going to see this guy's shot coming. This guy is an excellent striker. What he wants to do is utilize his footwork, his takedown defense, and land hard strikes to get the victory. Well, Bruce Lee was quoted as saying the best fighter is someone who can adapt to any style, and Bruce Lee himself certainly fits the bill. The founder of Jeet Kune Do and the man Dana White calls the father of modern mixed martial arts, he is perhaps the most influential martial artist of all time. As good a combination of speed, striking, unpredictability, and precision as we've ever had in martial arts, good to see Bruce Lee making the UFC walk tonight. This guy has incredible takedowns. The speed in which he delivers them and the power in which he executes them are world class. Our tale of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. So a more than five year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, with big differences in height and reach. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out United Center in Chicago, Illinois. <laughs> This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 16 feet inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds, fighting out of Kanagawa, Japan, the Apex. And now we can see the opponent. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee! All right, went through the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. Want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in, because it's about to go down right go now. Well, it seems like this is an annual stop for the MMA leader as we are back and now underway with live action from the United Center in the Windy City, Chicago, Illinois. All right, here is Bruce Lee getting ready for another UFC start as we begin round one. So fast, so quick, so good at setting up striking angles, and it's hard to simulate the speed in training. I know the opponent has talked a lot about trying to find training partners to simulate Bruce Lee. Easier said than done. Bruce Lee trying to get off to a good start tonight. Oh, head kick blocked, though, by Lee. All right, first round is underway. You better watch out for the overhands. They will come early. They will come often here tonight. And even when you do your homework, it doesn't mean you can stop it. We'll see if he can get off to a good start here tonight. Nice jab. Oh, 
try to establish that jab. Oh, good kick. Takes a lot of practice to make a jab look that easy. Lands flush again. Now he goes for the single leg. Oh, right hook attempt, no good. Well, his opponent's got the read now, Joe, as he lands the punch to the head. He's got to change up his striking pattern and the tempo, or he's going to continue to be vulnerable to that count. Lee gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Head kick is blocked. Just over three minutes now to go. Lee gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Gotta shore up the defense here, though. And he connects there, Joe. Nice kick. And he gets the single leg takedown. And busy as he looks to improve position here. Lands a strike now from the bottom. Nice work there by Lee. Beautifully executed sweep. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Half guard. Lands a good shot from the bottom. Comfort zone. He hit him with an axe kick. Very nicely done. Uppercut there blocked by Lee. Oh, tags him with the jab on the counter. It's a nice back and forth action here. Oh, how about the output for this fighter here? A lot of good time shots there, and they're all landing. Showing that punch. Lee gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. And he lands the hook. Takedown attempt there. And he completes a single leg takedown. In the side control, nicely done. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Back up to his feet again. Oh, now he's got the tight clinch, Joe. Well, this is live in real time. We didn't hit the replay button. Again, he gets cracked to the head because, again, he's leaning in, almost moving right into his opponent's striking range. Joe, nice head movement there. Slip that right hand. Hit him with the jab. No, the left leg goes high. Really missed with that right hand. Check the high kick. Lee gets tagged with that jab. Pretty good weapon for him tonight. Oh, now he's got double underhooks here. Over underhooks here. And plenty of time with which to work. 30 seconds to go in the round. Double underhooks. We'll see what he can do with it. Lee's pummeling works in that underhook. Caught him with a punch. And they separate. Well done to block that powerful kick to the bottom. Second right, round straight ahead. Move, 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 move. Let's take a look at some of the action from that round. And here's a nice shot, lands perfectly. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. Brittany Palmer in the building as usual. Round two, you ready? You ready? All right, here we go with round two. 
All right, so second round getting underway now. Not a bad first round. Both fighters had their moments. Looked like at times they were just getting warmed up a little bit, perhaps a little bit of a feeling out process over that first minute. What's your thoughts on what we saw there in that first round? Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Lee's strike attempt there is blocked. Blocking all the shots coming towards his head. Oh, spinning back fist out of nowhere. Oh, beautiful right hook. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Total strikes. He got tagged there. Oh! Lee gets caught with that punch. Well, he got his head snapped back by that straight hand there, and he's shown a vulnerability tonight by leaning right into that punch as he tries to set up his own offense. May want to focus on some defense here moving forward. Oh, excellent exchange there. Once again, moving to his left here, trying to avoid the power in his opponent's right hand. Lands with the right hand. Oh, beautiful technique for him there on that side kick. Nice body shot. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Just out of range with that right hook. Good takedown defense, very nicely done. And he's looking for that left. Oh, he lands another strike to the body here. He's really starting to connect Joe on a lot of these strikes to the midsection. Three minutes now to go in round two. Beautiful timing with the left hand. Oh, good left hand. Big left hand. Body kick, look at that. Oh, that punch will count. Landed flush. Huge uppercut misses. Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward, combinations. Throw your punches and bunches and really try to force the issue and get your opponent out of it. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here. And as a result, he has taken control of this second round. His guillotine is nasty. Oh, and there it is. He got the choke for the tap. Well, yeah, so the work in the gym pays off here tonight as he gets the win by submission. Gorgeous setup on the choke, and I think even better execution down the stretch. Clearly, it was sunk in deep. His opponent had no choice but to tap or take a nap. In this case, he chose to tap out. And here we see it from another angle. Beautiful technique here, and the tap. And finally, one more time, no choice but to tap. So there he is, your winner by submission. That is a finish they will likely be talking about for some time. Big win, major statement made to the rest of this division. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Lugliante has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 56 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by tap out. Bruce the Dragon Lee! Well, what else can you say about Bruce Lee after a performance like this one? Seemingly everyone on the roster wants to take their cracks against one of the founding fathers of mixed martial arts. And candidly, thus far, few men have succeeded. This just might have been Bruce Lee's best performance inside the octagon.